Hey you all welcome to service now for beginners today we'll be talking about impersonation impersonation is a very powerful option in service now using impersonation you will be able to impersonate any other user and see what they are seeing for example you are a system administrator but you but there is someone who is complaining of not being able to see a menu properly so what you can do is you can impersonate that person and see exactly what their problem is so this is one of the users there are many other users that way impersonation can be a powerful tool to diagnose to see and to understand a lot of things inside service now so let's look at how we do it so uh, to impersonate you have to actually go to the right top of your screen and on that little picture you will see that there is an option to impersonate a user okay now click on that and you will see a pop up window where which comes with a search bar in that search bar you can search for any name that you want uh let's say you want to search for a certain john john adams bonham chipley kennedy or or whoever let let's just select john kennedy and you will see that uh, their name option is available and when you when you select that name and click on that uh suggestion and click on impersonate user you will start impersonating uh, john kennedy this will take like a second or two it, it won't take longer than that and because uh, you are logging in for the first time as john kennedy you will see those uh, initial pop up options again uh, which are not necessary right now you can just close them or click on next or whatever uh, just move on So basically you are seeing what John Kennedy would be seeing when they log into their screen this is the advantage of uh, impersonating a user and uh, you can also end impersonation there's a new option i mean like two or two versions ago this option was not there but uh, now it is there uh, you can just click on end impersonation and it will take you back to your own uh, original users uh, login see i'm back as system administrator here and uh, you can uh, impersonate as any other user you want and there is also an imp- uh, you know there is also an option to impersonate as some other user all right you can see there uh, that there is uh, you are you are back as john kennedy again but there is an option to impersonate another user yeah so let's just take a look at that uh, let's go back as john kennedy oh, i clicked that by mistake and from here impersonate another user and when you click on that from john kennedy you will be able to log in as anyone else you want like let's look for alex there's no alex here i'm so sorry <laughs> uh yeah anyone alfonso yeah alfonso is fine let's select uh, alfonso and you will be able to impersonate as alfonso and see again there is a first time that um, dialog box popping up and that's how you uh, use the impersonate option just click end impersonation and you'll go back to as the original user you will be logged back in as the original user so that's how you use the impersonate option uh, thank you for watching and uh, yeah so please subscribe and share if you liked it thank you